Hi everybody, welcome back to Majestic Collectibles Mystery Action Figure Box Search 62. Now I have to give a preference here. You've probably noticed by now that videos uh, 58 and 59 are not on uh, YouTube. And I don't know what happened, but the files got corrupted. And I've been spending like two, three days on and off trying to salvage it. And, and it's just gone at this point. Um, I don't think we missed much. A lot of Star Trek, Star Wars, Spawn, a little bit of G.I. Joe. I don't recall anything really rare standing out. So uh, I do apologize. Uh, I did film them, um, did download them, did save them. And something happened, I think, probably during maybe the save process. I don't know. But the uh, main files got corrupted, so I can't save them. So I do apologize again for that. Um, I'm going to do something a little different today. You'll notice these are not the standard fruit boxes. And that's on purpose because quite honestly the last uh, 30, 40, maybe even 50 boxes there have not been a lot in there. It's been real heavy Star Wars, Star Trek stuff. And I've got 200 of these long boxes. They're made for comics. They hold about 250 uh, comics if they're bagged and boarded. Close to 400 modern age comics if they're just raw you know, unprotected. So I thought, well, I needed the room. I wanted to change it up a little bit. It was getting stale. See if we can find something new and fun. Um, I don't know. Uh, I do know what some of the stuff is in here. If you see, the, you can tell the lids are crooked, and that'll become very apparent why here shortly. Uh, so we'll get started. If you don't mind, uh, click like, hit subscribe, leave us your questions and comments. Uh, these will probably be on uh, our eBay store, Majestic Collectibles on eBay, by the time you see the video. Well, hopefully see this video. Um, 60 and 61 seem to have turned out okay, and the what sold on eBay uh, we shot this morning is up. That came out all right. So hopefully it's just a fluke thing and um, it won't happen again. Hopefully not. So here we go. I'm just going to start here on the left. And you can tell right away... Here's the problem with these boxes is a lot of this product sticks just above the edge. So the box lids don't fit. It looks like the box lids were just set on there and then they piled stuff on top. So again, a lot of, a lot of curled and warped um, cards on there. Nothing too bad. And this is all Cubics? Gotta tell you, never heard of it. It's Warner Brothers, so it must have been a WB Kids show, and let's see, what was the year? Back in 2001, so, you know, 20 plus years ago. Uh, these had stickers on them, price stickers, I'm guessing from the, uh, the person I bought it from. I know he did tell me, and I don't know if he went to shows or flea markets or antique mall, I don't know how he did it. I know um, he did put these... Uh, in long boxes and take them to show so people could flip through them, you know, and just, just thumb through them as you went. And since there's no uh, no dealer number, I'm betting that was probably some type of show or flea market. 350, oh, that one's stuck good is what's on there. Mong! Um, so I don't know, I'll have to do some research on Cubics. Not at all familiar with that. Let's see, box number two. Got some more Last Action Hero. Um, oh no, wait, man, this might be the first Last Action Hero. I think I was uh, thinking of Demolition Man. So the Schwarzenegger movie. Yeah, I don't, whoops. Yeah, I don't think I've had any of these, so this will be interesting. Again, these have price stickers on them. Six fifty. Boy, they're still crammed in here tight. I can't hardly move one without taking two or three along. I'll just pull them out. Uh, got some FF, um, Invisible Woman, another Invisible Woman, Fire Lord, might be seeing him in some upcoming Marvel movies, X-Men X-Force, Kill Spree 2, Cable Stealth, Shatterstar 3, Kill Spree 2, the 2 and 3 are the... Uh, not really variants, they're just a different series where they gave them different uh, different look, maybe different weapons on it. Uh, Psylocke, that one should be okay. 
I'm not familiar with the classics. Batteries included. That, that could be bad if those things corroded, but I don't see any signs of damage. 96. 96 on that one, on the Psylocke. I think that's the only classics in there. And then another X-Force cable stealth. So kind of an interesting box. The Marvel stuff isn't always super high valuable, but it usually uh, usually sells. Oh, now here we go. That's what I was thinking of in the uh, first place. No, not, not Justice League. I like that Hawkman, though. Laser Superman. Here's what I was thinking of when I uh, saw the last action hero was the Demolition Man stuff that I had before. And I don't think I've sold... Uh, God, I don't think I've sold any of it. It hasn't been on very long, maybe a week. And I've got a few different ones. I think all the other ones will, were uh, Sylvester Stallone, so I've got a few, few extra ones I can throw on there. And there's some more Last Action. Heat Pack and Jack. Axe Swing and Ripper. Pretty much looks the... Uh, Looks the same as the other ones. Uh, yep, I don't think Hook Launch, Launch and Danny. That might be a. That might not have been in the first box. And we'll go to the box number four. It sure is easier pulling these out when they're not all interlocked and mashed together. Bastard. Oh, Babylon Five. A uh, real cult following with a lot of Babylon 5 stuff. Probably going to be a little better than the Star Trek and Star Wars, which I don't know. I don't know if that's that big a deal now that I say that. That's kind of a low hurdle. It was a great series. If you guys like sci-fi and have never seen the B5, um, it was really good. And let's see. Gakar... Okay, well there we go, kind of some interesting stuff there, and this, um, well let's see, I think I brought 20 of these long boxes home, so I guess there'll be, what, if my math is correct, five different, uh, five different videos at four boxes each, so we'll go through, we'll try them for now, see what happens, hopefully we'll get some more hits on some rare stuff, and we will go from there. So check out our other videos, and thanks for watching.